Hi, my name is Dan Dalton, and I'm an attorney with the law firm of Dalton & Tomich in Detroit, Michigan, and I'm a religious land use attorney. Today we're going to talk about a federal law called RELUPA, the Religious Land Use and Institutionalized Persons Act. So what is RELUPA? RELUPA has been described as the great equalizer in religious land use law. What it does is it puts religious entities on the same path in the same standards as secular entities. A lot of municipalities prior to the enactment of RELUPA would not allow a, uh, a religious entity, whether it's a church, a school, temple, synagogue, cemetery, campground, to be located within their uh, borders because of loss of tax space or some form of discrimination. Well, what Congress did is it said, if you're gonna allow a secular assembly, like a theater or a city hall or a fraternal organization to be located in a zoning district, a religious organization should be allowed to be there as well. It doesn't give churches or religious organizations extra rights or is not a super zoning uh, organization or a super zoning ordinance for religious organizations. It just levels the playing field for them. This is a federal law, so it applies all over the United States. But the interesting thing about this law is that each circuit defines the law a little bit differently. So it's very important to understand where you're at and what the law is and how it's defined where your, where your institution is located. If you have more questions about RELUPA, if you have questions about developing land, or if you bought a building and you found out later that you can't use it because of zoning regulations, call one of the professionals at Dalton & Tomich. We're here to help.